that case of uh, animal abuse on Long Island and a man who was hired to take care of those animals at a dog daycare is now facing charges accused of hurting them. He worked at Pollywood in Massapequa and that's where Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles is live with more. Darla. David and Liz, police say the owner of Pollywood saw those videos, saw that action on video and surveillance video, and then they're the ones who called police and reported their own employee. That video has not yet been released, but I've spoken to investigators who have seen it, and they say it's one of the most disturbing cases they've ever seen. 21-year-old Andrew Laurenti surrendered to police last night. He faces animal cruelty, torturing, and failure to provide sustenance charges. This happened at Pollywood Daycare Boarding and Grooming on Chestnut Street here in Massapequa. Police say Lorindy is seen on video swinging multiple small dogs by their leashes over his head, kind of like a lasso, and then releasing those leashes so that the dogs fly down the hallway and smash their heads into a fence. Those dogs suffered minor injuries, but are okay. Nassau County Police and the District Attorney's Office and detectives from the ASPCA here in Nassau County are all investigating this incident. They say this is not something to be taken lightly. This case is a classic precursor to other violent crime. This is how people start. Jeffrey Dahmer started on animals. The Columbine shooters started on animals. Almost every one of our mass murderers started on animals. You start, you, you deaden your senses, and you move on from small animals to large animals, eventually to humans. Now, 21-year-old Andrew Lorendi again arrested on animal cruelty charges, caught on surveillance video abusing small dogs at Bollywood Doggy Day Camp here in Massapequa. Police say uh, he was fired immediately by the owners here after they saw the video. However, they... Um, have yet to release a statement. We're waiting to hear back from them. And again, it's not even known how long he has worked here, but investigators are trying to determine whether or not there are any other cases involving Lorindy. They are concerned about that. They're also concerned about two dogs that are in the Lorindy home under his care. They say they want to try to get access to evaluate those dogs.